I'm no, I'm by no means a mechanic, but this, this seems pretty fucked to me. 1989 LE Holden Nova with a twin cam, 16 valve, uh, carbureted engine. As you can see, I don't know much about engines, but I'm pretty sure those aren't meant to be burnt. And I'm pretty sure that one's meant to have oil on it. Post-production and far later, uh, me, this is from 2024 that I'm speaking. Yeah, they're not meant to have oil. So I guess any one of the cylinders was working properly. Here's some tasteful door damage. Um, obviously broken door handle, the classic. It works on the inside. Oh, and a uh, broken uh, window. Get ourselves over to the boot. Um, it, it doesn't lock. Also kind of broken there. And this uh, light isn't even connected. In fact, it was floating on the floor when I bought the car. You got a good car when none of your tire brands are identical. <laughs> hey, the interior is nice. Well, somewhat. It's got the classic crawler syndrome of this seat being completely buggered these being completely fucked, and the passenger seat being actually pretty nice. With a gentle 232,000 kilometers and a very dodgy aftermarket radio, you can own this car for 150 bucks. But why would you? Let's keep this last bit very brief. Essentially, bought the car for 150 bucks, sold it for 150 bucks, and that was out west, and now it's sitting in a field somewhere, abandoned and shit. Yeah, look, the car was crap, and I'm not going to sort of sugarcoat it. I bought it for parts. I got my money out of it. Sold it on. It was great. One quick aside before we go. They didn't clean the car, so I ended up getting a bunch of random shit out of it, including three actually decent batteries. Car batteries, that is. So, one of the few cars that I've actually won on. That doesn't happen often.